Like, what's him going in circles going to do? Probably trying to dazzle us. Trying to... Trying to finesse us with his fine fire dancing skills. I got news for them. You're fired! Or I'm fired. That's what I'm... That's what I call having a blast. <laughs> Again, I apologize for the stream cutting out, it's just issues every once in a while. I, again, I, I talked about this earlier, but I think it might have been um, just based on um, connection, so there's that. Um, oh, okay. I, No, it's not on your end, it's just connection issues every once in a while. Um, because I talked about this earlier whenever Acer, Acertist was watching. Um, it might be possible that it's because of how many people are also using the Wi-Fi here at my, uh, folks' house. Shit, I don't have enough to get an upgrade. Grass. Uh, I was gonna see if I could, but then I saw how many opals I had, and so I was like, wait, I can't get that. Plus, the only upgradable boomerangs I could really get are the multi-ring, um, the lava ring, or the omega ring. That's it. Show me the map in the corner. Oh. Oh. I'm gonna see some here. I mean, I could just pause it. You know, I can't. Uh. Okay, so. Oh, now I know why that orange star's over at Burumaji. It's because of the food mission. We're gonna have to get the food. Um... Oh. I came from, uh... Over there. Yeah. Like, the gray ones, I think, is just missions I've already done. The outlines, I think, are for something else. I don't know. Uh, also, I like how on the mini map it shows a circle for this little spot. But in the actual pause menu, that's the uh, thing. No, not yet. Um. I'm on the second quarter of the game. Like, um... I finished Patchy a little while ago, so I just finished the Volcano mission. I'm also grinding pavement. Whoa! Sliding away. I guess I'll go ahead and do the food mission. That's really fast. That's the wrong way. Actually, no. That is the right way for whenever I'm actually doing the mission. Whee! <laughs> Ha 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 ha! 
<laughs> well, that was fun. <laughs> All right. That doesn't happen to me very often. <laughs> Okay, um... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wait, you just go like, WOO! Boom! Just lay it on your head. <laughs> Hello, Tom. E R I F. Irif! Actually, it's fire. <laughs> um, oh, Dennis. Uh, Alright, Dennis, time to see what gourmet meals you have for the. Whatchamabobs. Oh, Ty! You're just in time! Prepare I've for. Uh, a smashing gourmet meal for the workers! <laughs> None of your boring old meat pies for my men. It's tofu cheese souffle made on soy milk and quail eggs with a dash of ginger. Sounds, uh, tantalizing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no thanks. I've, uh, already eaten. Oh boy, time limit. I can't wait to see what happens if I finish the mission. Greetings, Thai unit. Can't talk right now, I have to get food to people or else it'll explode. <laughs> Wait, no, that's another mission. <laughs> uh, at least the loading for this little area is quick. Unlike the consoles on a... <laughs> it's just like, readings tie unit. I think it's called Grub Grab. Yeah. Actually, what's really funny is, uh, according to the original version of this game on the old consoles it used to be on, or not used to be, but was originally released on, the song that plays in this mission is also called Grub Grab. Which I think is really, really funny. Yeah, I think the stuff he says is just like sort of computer program jokes. What about a rug rat? Wait, what? Oh, I mean the mission name is called Grub Grab. Like, grabbing some grub. And it just so happens that the song that plays is also called that. lunch any minute now. They've been hanging out for their meat pies with mushy peas. You guys are koalas, why would you eat meat pies? This smells like an explosion in a manure factory. That'd be the parmesan cheese. Well, they're as hungry as half-starved emus, so here's hoping they won't notice. Mm -hmm. The Pippi Beak Snippers are having a surf carnival today, Ty, but they forgot their sunscreen. Rex and L have a supply of zinc cream ready to go. Would you be a top bloke and make sure the nippers get their sunscreen? I heard that very wrong for a second. <laughs> and no, I'm not talking about the N-word, I'm talking about nipples. <laughs> it, it does sound like it though. It does sound like they're saying something about like someone's nipples. I don't mean to sound like a perv or anything, it's just, it just sounds like that. That's the joke I was getting at. And it just so happens, Ripper Nipper. I 
I guess that's the Australian equivalent of a purple nipple. Lizard. Glad you could make it, doll. Rex left for the surf carnival, but he forgot to take the zinc cream with him. What are you talking about? I'm right here. Sometimes I reckon he'd be better if it wasn't attached to Tell me whatever you want. That's no good. Can you take it down to South Beach for me? But hurry, the first event starts soon. No worries. Alright, time to race to the... something or other. Take that, Crash Bandicoot. You may be able to drive vehicles, but can you throw boomerangs? I didn't think so, and ironically, he's also an Australian animal. And unlike Ty, he is a science experiment. Ty is a natural born animal. Ah, oh, Ty! Look how fast you that was. Just in time. You're a dead set legend, mate. I oh, died. Let the kids out without their sunscreen. <laughs> Ty, what are you doing? Bruno is still stuck in the frill neck forest. When you get a chance, you should go and help him out. Oh yes, this mission. Oh boy, this mission. The Bruno mission. The mission I'm about to do actually uh, is funny. The mission has to do with a phobia that I used to have. Bye! Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it. I was gonna grab those as soon as I. That's twice I missed that. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> I bit it just as it shot, so it's like. This mission, the character that you have to rescue, Bruno. The dialogue that you'll hear from him is something that has to do with a phobia that I actually used to have. First, we have to actually get through this mission. But that should be simple. I always get worried about saying that word because Twitch is like, you can't say the S word. So like, let me get this straight, someone in chat, and probably somebody in the stream, like, you know, whoever's streaming, like, say for example they're talking about stuff they have to get from a grocery store, for whatever reason, they say, not for whatever reason, like, Say, for instance, the streamer says, Oh, hey, um, I noticed that I'm out of. 
olive oil and it has to be extra virgin. Twitch is like, oh, you can't say that. Like, okay. Apparently it's profane language. But like, the other problem is, you know, the S word. Which happens to be a part of the word simple. You know, as in easy. So anytime I say something along the lines of that when I'm streaming, I always get super worried because I'm like, oh god, what if I get in trouble? But I think I should be fine. I think it has to do with the chat, though. Haha! <laughs> You're still there, right? Alright. Prepare for dialogue that had to correlate with the fear I used to have. Hi there, Bruno. What are you Not doing bad. here? <laughs> I'm trying to face my fears. You see, I suffer from hypsophobia. Acrophobia! You're scared of hippies? No, scared of heights. Acrophobia! I if I face my fears, I could overcome them. So did it work? It did, until I looked down. Don't worry, mate. I'll help you down. Thanks, Ty. I think I'll work on my fear of heights at home. I'll start by using a stepladder. Okay. Ranger Ken and Duke are tagging crocs down Muddy Bottom Way. Duke, you pop talking about Duke Nukem? It's time to kick ass and chew bubble gum, and I'm all out of gum. <laughs> Kidding. Uh... Run, 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 run. I don't want to be here now. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um. Oh, come on, Shazza. Your car is an off roader. You can totally make that. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> okay, thanks, game. Did you know the 4B has a quad cam engine with fuel injection and 32 valves? Oh, and it's also got a heated cup holder. Useful for keeping hot chocolate warm on a cold winter's day. Mmm. -hmm. Not sure how that's useful to me. I think there was another factoid, and it was talking about, oh, it's so strong in terms of how much weight it can carry that it can hold like a whole bunch of manure. And then it goes on to say, don't worry Ty, it's all been hosed down. It's so funny. Um... Oh, that's the dentist freeway. We're gonna do that after. I'm gonna go ahead and do the crock thing. The super size salty. Salt! Sheesh, look at all the shrubbery here. Oh, I thought I was gonna hit Ranger Ken. It didn't. That bag over there, I believe, gives you a thousand opals, which is really useful. Is it? 200. I was wrong. By. Uh, under 800. It's true. It's a good thing you're here, mate. We need a hand tagging these crocs. Count me in! Well, one mate, we'll be using a boat and a chopper to round them up. I'll steer the boat toward the crocs. You use the chopper to pick them up and move them over the pontoon. Duke will drop them and I'll tag them. No worries. 
Forgot the A button. So you gotta get ten of these guys. and getting some trucks. I'm not talking about the footwear either. <laughs> I'll admit, they make the water look super pretty in this game. Even in the old version. Like, in the original. Sound like the crocodile said, yeah. This is incredibly easy. So easy that a four year old could probably do it. <laughs> the crocodile sounded like it said, Yay! Ah! Almost hit a tree. You will be my pet. I shall call you George and pet you and love you and cherish you and whatever else that Yeti guy said in, uh, Oh, I forgot I could zoom out the camera. <laughs> yes. Right. Come on along with me. I will take you with the tree. <laughs> Can't wait. The whole place is gonna blow unless you do something about it. This is top priority time, so get cracking, mate. Can't wait. I uh, kind of have to save someone's memorial freeway because apparently it's, it's uh, of the utmost importance. Please. Can we? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I made it as soon as I could. What's the emergency? Oh, it's just terrible, Ty. Terrible. What is it? Terrible. Who needs saving? My freeway is in trouble. Is Cash responsible? Did he blow it up? No, no, no. I was building the Dennis Memorial Freeway when the workers walked out on me. Dennis Memorial Freeway? 
they were complaining about my fastidious scrutinizing. I told them the fuchsia brickwork clashed with the faux teak timber trim. It simply wouldn't do. You need a fashionable counselor, freeway? It's simply terrible. The freeway is so close to being finished. I just need a few extra pieces put in place. Will you help Duke find those pieces and put them in the right spot? Pretty please. You've got it, Captain! I played GTA if you're interested. <laughs> Alright, uh... Die, bird! Oh, there we go. Isn't it funny how we're killing birds in front of the bird? Also, how did it survive an explosion? That one didn't. So this song is cool. Forgot what this song is called, but it's like one of my favorite songs in this game. I gotta say, like, Ty the Tasmanian Tiger in general has some really good music. I mean the series as a whole. Okay, I will. Dead bird. Bird is dead. <laughs> yeah, like, if you look at the actual highway, it just looks like a normal highway. Alright. And. Last, but certainly not least, I have a question. How the fuck did these things get spread out like this? Seriously. There we go. Woo! Goodness gracious me, you did it! I hereby declare the Dennis Memorial Freeway officially open! open. Thank you, Ty. No worries. Cass's goons are all over Wooly Wooly Oil Rig like blowies at a barbie. Get down there before the place goes up faster than an umbrella in a rainstorm. I can understand the umbrella in a rainstorm, but what the fuck is a blowy? You're doing Australian slang for blowjobs now? <laughs> I'm sorry! <laughs> Me and my dirty humor. Occasionally dirty humor. That's dirty. Why can the boomerangs are just homing in? As you 
can see, it is indeed under fire. Sky high. Be careful, though. Kaz's troops are out in force. All right. Uh. Rally the troops. Actually, no. Don't do that. This song is cool. I forgot what the name was though. As with every song in this game. I gave him a bath in his anger. We're in the 10,000 ranges of opals. Also, I'm about to die. Oh boy. They died.
Hey, my... Uh... Someone I follow on Twitter. I mean, uh, their stream. check something.
was checking my emails and uh, there was a reply to this comment I made on a NES Godzilla themed video. I think it was like just the OST. And uh, Them be some angry lizards. This boss, then I'm probably gonna end the stream. And there's a hole. Strength! Well, I've got what I came for. Time to move on. Not without a fight! I was thinking the same thing. Buster, take care of me. <laughs> I like how he's still time, time, angry. Time. Like, he saw his that pissed off face. Just <laughs> staring her down. Anyway. It ain't no Iron Giant, but it ain't Jolly either. Instead, it's, uh... Oh. <laughs> the second I start the fight, it immediately attacks me and kills me. That attack always scares the shit out of me.
started. What's that? It's a machine that creates a holographic resonant image of the deoxyribonucleic constituent of any tissue sample. In, In English? English my, ooh, uh, it maps out your genetic structure. It shows what you're made of using pretty pictures. Ah, That's just talking Why would Cass want that? I don't know. After all, it's useless without the power of a grid processor. Oh, my. What's wrong, Julius? I remember reading about a break-in at Carbon <sighs> University last month, and the only thing stolen was a grid processor. I bet you top dollar Fluffy stole it. Boss Cass is up to something. Something big. You may be right, Shaza. I need to work out what Cass is doing with all those parts. Let me know how you go, Julius. In the meantime, I've got some bush rescue jobs to do. The bioorganic microscavalizer. Julius has excelled himself yet again. Will you stop doing that? <laughs> Let us begin the test. Well, what are you waiting for? Turn it on! The scanalyzer will extract the genetic information from the mammal specimen, then use the grid processor to calculate which attributes we want for our trail soldier. In real life, this would kill the lizard. qualities of a reptile and a mammal. Excellent! Now I can create an unstoppable army! I'm a genius. No, you're not. Mm, there are side effects for the mammal, that is. So cold. That's not a side effect, that's a feature. It'll make a great bullet point on the side of the box. <laughs> the only thing we're lacking now is a large supply of unsuspecting mammals. <laughs> Don't worry about that, Carlos. I know exactly where we can find some. <laughs> he turned into Wario! Okay, mate. Those lovable Hollywood stars Beryl and Squeaver are in trouble again. Only this time it's for real. Looks like Cass's hoons have dressed up as film extras and are trying to destroy their film set. Stop them. I'm not so sure about that. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Uh, sheep dip, 
Tears of Chartering Inferno. Our Crocodile of Chaos. This mission right here caused me some trouble whenever I was younger. This mission is just rounding up crocodiles. Oh boy, no crocodiles. Tourist Trap is uh, fixing up ridge at Fair Dinkum, which by the way, that is actually Australian slang. That is another one of those, say it with me, save two lovable Hollywood types only to be scolded by Fox Guy. I wish I was kidding, but I am not. Uh, sheep Dip is another helicopter mission. <sighs> Anyway, uh, I think that'll about do it for tonight. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this. If you did, then, uh, follow if you want. Let your friends know all about my channel. And, uh, yeah. Um, like I said, I will be uploading the video on demands onto YouTube, uh, as soon as I can tomorrow. So... Uh, what I plan on doing is just, as soon as I can tomorrow, I'm going to upload the VOD for the streams. I say streams because it cut out at numerous moments, so I'm going to upload them in sequential order. So, yeah, anyway, thank you for watching, and uh, yeah. see you all next time on Tie the Tasmanian Tiger 2. Where's Rusty? Yeah. Also, this is this is my background. Yeah. Um. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. Night. <laughs>